Hello! Hi. Welcome back to our channel. So we are doing a kind of spontaneous video today. We have, as we've mentioned before, we've been obsessed with Marie Kondo on Netflix and we kind of started sorting and tidying, didn't we? And we got, we donated, what, four, five bags? To, today. To charity today and then decided, you know what, we're in the sorting frame of mind, why don't we go to Home Bargains and add to our organisation. So, Home Bargains haul, let's go. Should we start with those? Okay. So, I like to stock up on hand wash. So, I always go for Carex Strawberry Laces, my favourite. I just like the smell, it's fresh and yeah. So when I see them cheap, and this was less than a pound, I want to say 89p, I was like, well grab a few of those, man. <laughs> sure, roll on deodorant. Like, we bought four of those, two each. Um, we've started going to the gym, so I'm going to have one of these in my bag for the gym, so it's constantly in there, and then one at home, and I think you're doing the same. Yep, brilliant. Mini eggs. They were down to 89p, 89p and so I was like, pound. yep, we need to get some sort. So we got four packs of those just to go in our cupboard. Right, exciting stuff. We got some bleach. It was again like 89p. I like it when they're less than a pound. It's exciting. So always useful just to stock ups. Stock ups, even. Cotton soft, cotton soft round pads things i find these ideal for makeup removal is yeah. that what you use it for like um, coconut oil it's yeah really so thing. stocked up on those it's made me go even paler because that was white um so we've got a few of those so some people will think what on earth are you doing yes it's a christmas scent but i don't care i like ziflora i use it to kind of clean the sides in the kitchen i use it to kind of spray around sometimes just to spice it up and this is the cranberry and orange scented one. Yeah, probably a Christmas one, but I don't care. I like the smell. So Christmas all year round here. You can talk about these. <laughs> bin bags. Um, we're very fussy about our bin bags because they rip so like easily. We had one full of charity shop stuff and by the end I was kind of having to lift it from the bottom because it ripped open. So heavy duty bin bags. <laughs> They're always good and there's like 50 of those. And yeah. the thing is we sometimes order them online, they arrive and we're like, oh, it's thin ones again. So you the fact that you can it, feel yeah. how strong they are. Um, I needed to get some more floor cleaner. I was gonna get a different brand and then I saw this Astonish. They seem to have a lot of Astonish. It was the same scent, so it's Orchid Blossom. Um, so I thought I'd give it a go. Apparently it's vegan, so even better joys <laughs> i've been a bit obsessed with these so we've got a couple of these i'm going to take one into work as a board rubber the the flash magic erases because they get rid of any whiteboard marks so you're taking one in and i'm going to use one at home i think yeah but i don't know they literally clean anything i think i'll keep it in the kitchen Maybe? You I don't know. Get, you if you've get, used one of these at home, please let me know best You can get bathroom place. special ones. You can get bathroom ones. Well, if I really like them. They were cheap again, weren't yeah. they? Yeah. Can't remember how much, do you? 89p, I think. I think most things, home bargains, 89p. We ran out of foil over Christmas, didn't we? So got some kitchen foil. Again, that was like, I want to say 69p. Mm. Wow. Wow. Who knows? <laughs> Stocked up on some toothpaste, we've got Colgate Deep Clean Whitening, always useful. I hate the idea of running out of things, so I like to just have it in the cupboard. And when it's so, that cheap, you might as well just Yeah, you may as well just grab one. Exactly. And then I saw one of these, I'm going to use in the kitchen. So it's like a little tray thingy, um, so I can put like sponge and like cloths and stuff and then maybe the hand soap or whatever uh, just to keep it together because at the moment it's all kind of just on the side and i'd rather keep it contained and it looks like you can probably take the bottom bit off because mm, that's what normally it. happens is it gets, gets, it gets a bit grubby in the bottom so yes i thought i'd grab one of those for kitchen organization our kind of beauty things we love our face packs we love all those kind of things so so we've 
quite often every time we go to a bargain place we end up leaving with some under eye it's really shiny uh, <laughs> under eye stuff you know. <laughs> it says coll gold collagen hydrogel under eye mask but basically it's just really cool and refreshing under your eyes yeah so uh, it brightens as well so we'll see if that's, that's how i put them on oh i've been doing it wrong <laughs> and then next to them there was this other one we thought we might try <laughs> we might have to take a photo and put it on instagram or something <laughs> there's a lip one yeah so rejuvenate and plump gold collagen hydrogel lip masks i didn't know it was a plump one yeah i'll be like Mm. <laughs> it'll be lovely and then i saw this and said please can we get it because it's a um regenerating peel off glitter mask like i just want to try it i hope it's as glittery as the person has on there so yes i'm excited they do quite good ones we got a gold the one we did before mm. was a gold one yeah we did hurt. a review of that and that maybe hurt. Hurt. She was we'll um, put the link off. below for that but we'll try this one as well so I'm excited. And then our typical weakness. Candles. So, um, well these two are the same colour. Are they the same scent? No. Oh. oh, we did a thing. Okay, so again, they had Christmas scents and we don't care. We like Christmas scents. All year round. Any time of year. So this one is a vanilla sugar cookies. To be honest, just vanilla it just smells like a nice kind of yeah vanilla one and they are all wickford and co yeah yeah and what have you got uh this isn't a christmasy one but it's vanilla and cashmere which is a nice vanilla <laughs> yeah smell vanilla these are wickford and co as well and these two are christmas these so are this christmas. is a warm apple and cinnamon best smell ever. which is dreamy and this and is that one oh man gingerbread gingerbread i could eat that oh <laughs> brings back memories <laughs> and we got one more i think this is a different make because it looks different yeah walnut avenue yeah um again this is apple delight that's nice and i liked it because it's a three wick candle yeah that makes me happy it's and really they're it's really, really nice, nice. <laughs> um we've had success with these brands before um yeah. we sometimes find when they're in a big jar like this you get to about midway and they start melting in their own wax it's a tragic story for all but we've just had one finish last night mm. didn't we like properly properly to the get end. to the bottom and we were like yes grand success so grand we lost success. one candle and we bought five so i think we've got the proportions right there so really what we went out to buy today <laughs> was storage so the first thing we were aiming for was one of our kitchen drawers you know that kitchen drawer well i don't know if you do but it like has potatoes and onions and pasta like the dry stuff so ours are all loose at the moment so we decided, you know what, let's contain and group it. Mm -hmm. So we started off we, yeah. with the spaghetti container. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong, except we have to lie it down because it won't yes, fit. Yes, it won't it's stand slightly up too in, tall the drawer, in the drawer. But uh, we can but lie it down. But it's quite a deep drawer, fine. so it's fine. We've measured it out. I, I placed all these tabs on the floor and measured it with my yeah. measuring tape. Yeah. Um, we're aiming for like I think onions in a tub this big yeah and garlic yeah in this tub so just to contain them I know it, that's probably not what people do but just that's what we're doing and, and then, then we got two tubs with lids we'll see if the lids stay on um that we're also going to put in there with like potatoes and, and pasta, pasta. So hopefully that will just keep it all tidy and separated. And you know when you get like loose onion skin, skin? Yeah. Peel? Skin. Feels wrong. Uh, skin. Like that just goes everywhere. And like potatoes, you know when they grow eyes and stuff, like we're trying to prevent that happening and everything. Nobody so needs any eyes. No one needs extra eyes, man. 
And the other thing, I mean, we haven't got everything we were looking for, have we? No. Because we wanted to find some boxes that could fit under our settees so that we could store our lap separately, store yeah. our laptops, this wires awkward. and stuff. Because but, it's shallower yeah. than under a bed. So I don't know. We, we might not need be a able tray. To find it. That's true. That's what we could look for. Mm. The other thing is we do keep some of our camera equipment downstairs. So we normally keep the tripod, tripod. Maria's big camera especially, and then chargers and stuff. So we were going for, well, let's contain it. Let's make it organized. And we've got ourselves a big kind of box. Crate thing. Crate yeah. thing. <laughs> Um, just to keep the camera and everything in and so it's just all like the whole point is having it just organized yeah like, and now we've got this we're gonna see if it actually fits our laptops and stuff we wanted other things stored in yeah under the bed uh, under the settees to see if it fits fit behind, it behind the settees or something. yeah um, so, so we're kind of testing it bit by bit to see what our yeah, long term plan is. Yeah, this will not be our last Marie Kondo kind of um, tackling thing. We're not quite doing it the same routine as her, are we? We no. kind of, we're focusing on a room at a time. So we've almost done with the living room. We just need to go through a few drawers and look at the stuff in there and then decide if we want to get little trays to organize the things in there. Then other than that, we've gone through absolutely everything in this room, including like under the stairs cupboard. So then I think it's moving on to the kitchen dining room kind of area. Yeah. And going through that. But it's so therapeutic. If you've not watched it, you really need to because it's like changed our lives. Some for the better, some for the worse. <laughs> I can't open my eyes right now. Okay. Um, <laughs> well, that was a successful shop. We weren't planning on getting it all, but it, none of it's like um, not like. I, I don't know. feel like I've let myself down. <laughs> no. <laughs> not yet, child. Not yet. Thank you for watching. Uh, let us know if you've tried any Marie Kondo, if you've used any. Like if you found any storage strategies or anything and where you like to do your bargain shopping because I honestly, I feel so happy that we've got all this like backup stuff. Love it. What? Okay. <laughs> Goodbye. Thank you for watching.